Okay, perfect. All right. Uh, Miss Lavender has a, something to share with us today. Hello. Good morning, everybody. I am here to talk to you all about the school magazine. How many of you know that we have a school magazine? Great. Well, I am lucky enough to get to make this magazine twice a year. And I love this magazine because it tells the stories about our school community and some of the very special people in it. This one is very special because it has two, actually three, of our favorite people right here from the Huff campus in it. So I have Emma and Eddie here with me. They're going to help me out because our friends who are in this magazine haven't even gotten to see it in print yet. So the first person that we want to recognize for people are Jackson Collins Binkley. Where are they? Jackson Collins allowed me to interview them and talk to them and their mother and father about their BMX biking. And they are in the magazine. So if you guys have a chance to check it out, you get to read all about what they do a lot of nights and a lot of weekends, right? Go guys. And then another person we featured this edition. So this one is also special because we are now featuring one teacher or staff member from each campus in each edition. So this one is Miss Patty. So Miss Patty, her story tells us all about how she came to Canterbury and then she's been in how many years? 24 years she's been here helping to raise children, um, all of the kids here on the house campus. And then we have one more special person because I really couldn't pull this magazine together if I didn't have help from a lot of people. So Miss Brittany Rangel. <laughs> Brittany is a writer, I don't know if you guys know that about her, but she volunteered to help us write an article for our uh, about Miss Patty this, um, in this edition. So thank you so much. Okay, so you guys, you can check out the magazine and print on your front office, but they're also online, so you can see them on our website. We send emails out about them. Like them, read them, share them with friends. It's a great way to share the story of Canterbury with everybody you love. Thank you. Thank you, girl. Okay, we'll do this quick. Read a 
Across America Proclamation. Whereas the citizen, come here, Brent. There we go. Whereas the citizens of Cambridge School, Florida, stand firmly committed to promoting reading as a catalyst for our students' future academic success, their preparation for America's jobs of the future, and their ability to compete in the global economy. And whereas Read Across America is a national celebration of Dr. Seuss's birthday. Therefore, be it resolved that I, Mr. Hall, head of school at the CETAP, principal of the Huff Campus, call all citizens of Canterbury to assure that every child is read to today, both in school and at home. And be it further resolved that this body enthusiastically engages in programs and activities to make America's children the best readers in the world. Now, we're going to sign that, Ms. Seatat, and I am going to sign. You want to hold this?